Monday, 7 o'clock, and I am so sleepy still. Um, Jen and I ended up going to bed really late last night. Um, not really late, we went to bed around like 12.30, which for me is really late. I usually go to bed around 11, 11.30. Um, and yeah, so I'm really sleepy, really tired. We actually woke up like around like two, I want to say, because Jen was coughing quite a bit. Um, so I wanted to see if he needed water. I think I asked him like three or four times and he kept saying no, that he didn't need water. And yeah, uneventful evening, but nonetheless, I'm still sleepy. Time for some coffee. Honestly, I wish that I could drink coffee in like really cute cups or like a really pretty clear glass But the only reason why I can't is because I'm really really slow about drinking my coffee And so I have to always have it in kind of like um, a thermos or like an insulated mug because I'm just so slow at drinking it So whether it's iced coffee, whether it's hot coffee, I take forever and no matter what, I always leave a little bit of coffee in my cup. Although lately I've been really good about trying to finish the entire coffee, but I don't know. That's just my thing. I'm like really slow. So I'll usually end up drinking my cold brew like throughout the day. So this whole, you know, insulated mug will be my coffee for the entire day. For breakfast, I think I'm going to have an egg and then I'm going to also have some toast. I've really been liking this. Cheesecake Factory brown bread. Um, it's like their really famous brown bread. This one. Um, so I'm going to make some toast. They have it in sliced bread form. Um, so I'm going to have some toast with some butter. Although it's not really butter, it's like margarine or buttery spread. It's the Earth Balance one. I like this because it's a really good um, alternative to butter. It's a little bit healthier. Bon appetit! I'm gonna add some Tostito salsa. This is the habanero one. Oh my god, it looks so gross on the outside of the jar. I love eating these cheesy eggs because the cheese gets really crunchy and tasty, like caramelized cheese. <laughs> I feel like I switch up my breakfast pretty often. Um, I usually tend to have like oatmeal and granola usually. Uh, but I'm out of my favorite granola. There's one by a brand called Love, I think, in um, like an apple cinnamon crumble with chia seeds. It's really good, but I only found, I can only find them at like Kroger Ralph's, um, not near my house at Stater Brothers or uh, Vaughn's. And so I'll have to go to Ralph sometime soon this week and then pick up some more granola because I usually like to have oatmeal in the mornings because I feel like it's pretty filling. It's really good. Oh my 
god, I love this bread so much. It's so good. If you guys haven't tried the Cheesecake Factory brown bread, it's a must. It's like kind of a little bit sweet and it has like a really, really good flavor. It's like a very nostalgic flavor for me. I think I've always liked Cheesecake Factory's brown bread. Good morning. Excuse me, you're in my spot. Okay guys, so I am currently on my lunch break. Actually, Mondays are a little bit shorter days for me um, with work, because uh, we usually have like staff meetings, and uh, Vanessa, my mentor teacher, and I usually do a lot of planning, AKA hanging out. <laughs> um, but anyway, I'm gonna head over to Panera, which is like pretty close to my house, maybe like 10 minutes away, and I'm going to be meeting one of my best friends for lunch. She's actually on her spring break. She's also in education, and so, we're going to grab lunch, hang out, um, and I think I might grab a little dessert because I feel like I'm feeling really low energy. So I just got to Panera and now I'm waiting for my friend to get here. Um, it's been such a long time since I've eaten here. I think the last time I came here was actually with her. I feel like we always come to Panera and... Um, or go to the mall. I feel like we kind of uh, dial it back to our middle school days. Um, and actually during college we would meet at Panera. We went to different colleges, but we would meet at Panera and then study together. Because I think before when we could eat inside, we had like really uh, comfy uh, cushioned seats. And we would just grab a coffee, a pastry, sometimes lunch, and then just study together. We would stay there for hours, and it was like free internet. Oh, I think she's here. She's like driving a really pretty sports car, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. Um, the part that they're seeing not work is late grade. So let's say you grade something, and then Tommy turns it in late. You try to resync again. Tommy's great. Okay, so now I'm going to get started on dinner. I'm going to be making sangyeopsal with kimchi bokkum. Um, it's basically like spicy pork with kimchi and basically I'm just going to saute it together. I also have some leftovers that my mother-in-law gave me, so I'll probably heat that up on a pan um, and have that with some rice. Um, and it should be pretty good. I feel like I've been kind of craving Korean food. I haven't had it other than like Saturday. I haven't really been making it. I've been making more like American food and Tex-Mex, so it should be pretty good. Korean food is like one of Jen's favorite foods, and so I'm always happy to make it for him. I'm still trying to perfect a lot of things, but I feel like as I'm cooking it, I'm like practicing and getting better. Uh, yeah. I'm just gonna uh, pass in 15 minutes. Okay, so that's the end of the night for me. Thank you guys for catching up with me and spending the day together. Um, I'm just gonna edit a video from Saturday, watch a little bit of TV, and just hang out with Ebby until Jen finished class, or finishes class. <laughs>